Welcome to Indrapilly Golf Club, host of the 2011 PCYC Charity Golf Day. Proudly brought to you by Skyfleet Toyota. We now cross to the seventh tee where we pick up the action. Go ahead. Make my day. Oh, that was self. What we've got here is a failure to communicate. <laughs> Lovers, never have to say sorry. <laughs> Fuck. Here's looking at you, kid. <laughs> Seventh hole, par three, 110 metres, downwind. A lot of players have been going through this green. Alan's hit it high, so the wind has got hold of it. And... It has also gone through the green. Beautiful shot, but he's pulled it left and it's staying left. Oh, he's played a lovely shot. It's going right at the heart of the green. I think it's the right distance. Yes, the boys are putting from about 20 feet for birdie. Peter Hobbins now, looking beautiful in pink. He's hit it out to the right. There's not much trees on this hole, but Peter's managed to find them. Right, Mark Canane now, over the ball, putting from about 18 feet down a very slippery hill. He's hit it. It better hit the hole. No, it's gone past and it will keep going past. He just needs to trickle it down to the hole. Lightning greens. He's just done just that. Right at the hole. Oh, it's just drifted by. Alan Tui now, lining up. Can he make a hero of himself? He started it just out to the right, but too far right, and it's also going past it. And they won't be using that one. Now the man in pink, Peter Hobbins. Is he the man to make a hero of himself? He's aimed it straight at the hole, but it's just drifted off to the left. Peter now will endeavor to conclude the hole with the par. And he does. Rams it in the back of the hole. Well done, boys. Yeah, no, Houston, we have a problem. Oh, I'd say with a bit more oh, concern. No. A bit more concern. <laughs> they made it back. <laughs> I think you could see David from space. A big backswing. She's hit it at the hole. It's jumped in. What a brilliant result. Crikey. Oh, the team have gone mad. He can't see a thing. Oh, I've got no lines. <laughs> hey, that was a good one. <laughs> the only thing that should be banned, Tom, is that hair. A lot of people have known this for miles past. Oh, green. Line it up. It's going to give it a red hot go. He's hit it with some pace. It's coming back towards the hole. He's rammed it in. And that's a fantastic birdie for the team from Ashmore Ants. Well done, boys. Oh, he's planking. He's got his planking shot. Well done, Steve. Do I make you horny, baby? <laughs> <laughs> In a word? Yeah. Lovely swing. She's hit it a long way, but it's the wrong way. Patrick, who used to have this hair when he was younger, he's got it back again today. Especially... <laughs> Bond. James Bond. <laughs> Tell you what, Sean Connery eat your heart out. Elaine was looking resplendent in her wig. Oh, it's been a Samson effect. Got rid of the hair, got rid of the ability to hold that putt. There's a big roll in the offering here if you can just pull this off. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? Do I make you horny, baby? Yeah. Here's Matt on the tee. He's teed that up really high. I think that ball's about to get a nosebleed. The team um, are more interested in the beverages at the moment than the golf. Definitely a bottle blonde. <laughs> we won't ask you to prove that. Hallelujah. They are now putting. And John Seabone hits. Where did it go, John? They're not very keen on it. It's only a three-man team, and one of them has been blinded by his hair. 
And that includes the people who are looking at him. Here we go. Darling, you know how I've stuffed up on you a few times. Love means never having to say you Don't touch me. <laughs> Here's one of Ashmore Ant's star golfers in Craig Green. Pink hair, green name, can he hit the green and make a hero of himself? And always, oh, <laughs> he missed. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. What did your silver rich are showing? <laughs> and Leslie Blake takes aim. Oh, it's a beautiful shot, straight at the green. It's landed on the green, it's running up towards the pin. Oh, it's just gone by the pin. Now, Ray, you were supposed to put a wig on. And Heidi's heroes won't be using that ball. <sighs> he knew he should have gone to the hairdresser before he came to golf. Here we are at the par 3, 7, 110 metres, villainous voyages, led by Michael Lever. Oh, he played a vicious swing, but the ball's still there. That hair is having an impact, but unfortunately the club isn't. Of all the, of all the gin joints in all the gin towns in all the world, she walks into mine. Do you want to give it one more go? Yeah. <laughs> of all the gin joints in all the towns in all the world, she walks into mine. Yeah. Rachel is a very happy lady and she is indeed the man for the moment. That deserves a Bundy.